Hello and welcome. Today we'll be talking about coordinating and subordinating conjunctions. I can identify and use coordinating and subordinating conjunctions in a sentence. Drag the words into the correct blank space of the sentences. Number one says Maria went to the park Blank, she ate an ice cream. So we have to find a word that goes in there, and that word is and. So we're using these words over here to fill in these blanks. Number two says, Jack wanted to swim. Blank, it was too cold. If you said but, you are correct. Number three, she was very happy. Blank, she lost her money until she lost her money. Number four, I will be, I will bring a coat. Blank, it is going to snow because, so because we go here. Number five. I want popcorn, blank, I watch the movie. Wow. Number six, Jackie was sad, blank, she called a friend to feel better. So is the word. Conjunction. The words you just dragged are all conjunctions. Conjunctions are words that join sentences or phrases together. Conjunctions are important because they can combine two thoughts together and make them flow more smoothly. Today we will be focusing on two types of conjunctions, coordinating and subordinating. Coordinating conjunctions. We use coordinating conjunctions when we want to combine two independent clauses. An independent clause is a full sentence on its own. Look over here. Independent clause. The dog was hungry. Coordinating conjunction is and. And the independent clause is his food bowl was empty. Coordinating conjunctions, fanboys. You can use the acronym fanboys to remember the coordinating conjunctions. This is fanboys written all the way down. We have for, and, nor, but, or, yet, and so. Four, I hate going to the store for, it takes so long to get there. And. I want ice cream and my sister wants to go for a bike ride. Nor, the cat refuses to eat his food, nor will he drink his water. But, Jen would like to play outside, but she has to finish her chores. Or, you can watch TV or you can play on the computer. Yet, I tried to go to bed earlier, yet I cannot fall asleep. So, the boy got an A on his paper, so he was happy, okay? Subordinating conjunctions. We use subordinating conjunctions when we want to combine an independent clause and a dependent clause. There is more focus on the independent clause than the dependent clause in this type of sentence. Independent clause. Jane got ready quickly. Subordinating conjunction is because and dependent clause is she overslept. Commonly use subordinating conjunctions. Below are some commonly commonly use subordinating conjunctions. Although, because, while, until, since, if, and as. So, here are some examples. 
Although Christine lost the competition, she tried her best. Because the child cried because his toy was broken. Wow, Jack's sister was tired while he was full of energy. Until she was feeling sad until she was given an ice cream sundae. Since. I have worked there since 1998. If I would only want to go if my friend goes. As the movie was not as good as I was expecting. Circle the conjunctions in the sentences. I need a vacation, but it costs too much money. The word is but. That's the conjunction. I eat dinner while watching TV. Wow. That's the conjunction there. The girl was so sad because she lost her necklace. Because Ray is reading and Pablo is writing. And you can be serious or you can be silly. Or... Do the sentences have coordinating or subordinating conjunction? The first one, I need a vacation, but it costs too much money, is coordinating. I eat dinner while watching TV. That is subordinating. The girl was so sad because she lost her necklace. That is subordinating. Ray is reading and Pablo is writing. That's coordinating. And you can be serious or you can be silly. That is coordinating. Drag the correct conjunction to the sentences. So instead of me dragging, I'm just going to move the gray bar. I have wanted to play guitar since I was young. That's the subordinating. The girl does not like the cat, blank, it bites her. Because it's the subordinating. I have not, blank, I have not seen Jaden. I hope he has had a good week. That's all dough that goes there, and that's subordinating. Kate has a pet rabbit, blank, it eats. Cheerio and it's coordinating. I am hungry. Blank, I will make a sandwich. So it's coordinating. Two, does she want to go to the game? Blank, does she want to go home? Or it's coordinating. Three. He stayed at work, blank, he was too tired to keep going until it's subordinated. So it says, read the passage. Jason thought that it was going to be a good day until it started to rain. He did not pack an umbrella because the weather forecast did not predict rain. He was late to school. His clothes were wet and his shoes were soaked. His teacher was not happy and told him he needed to be more punctual. Then Jason took an exam. He studied so hard last night, yet he did not get a good grade. Could this day get any worse? So it wants us to highlight the coordinating conjunctions in blue and the um, subordinating conjunctions in red. Choose three coordinating conjunctions and use them in a sentence.
So right now you can take three or pick three of these and I want you to take out a sheet of paper and I want you to choose three coordinating conjunctions and use them in a sentence. But before we do that, I want you to go back here and I want you to write down the coordinating conjunctions. We're not going to do it in blue. We'll just write down coordinating on one side of our paper and subordinating conjunctions on the other side. So I want you to look at this passage again, and I want you to write the coordinating conjunctions on one side, that's in this passage, and the subordinating conjunctions on the other side. Okay? So I'll give you time to do that. So now we're going to come back and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to underline all the coordinating conjunctions in blue. So let me go ahead and get my blue pencil so I can underline those first. So in our first sentence, let me see if there's any. You see if you can find any in the meanwhile. So these were the ones that I found. Um, so make sure that you have these. I don't see any more. But these were the ones that I found. The coordinating conjunctions are in blue and the subordinatings are in red. And again, subordinating uh, um, are words like although, because, while, until, since, if, and as. And coordinating, if you write the word fanboys all the way down your paper, you'll get the words for, and, nor, but, or, yet, and so. Okay, so those are in blue. So here's the answers here. So it says choose three coordinating conjunctions and use them in a sentence. So I'm going to give you five minutes to pick three of them. Pick any three and write them in a sentence. It can be any sentence. Just write them in the sentence. And now choose three subordinating conjunctions and use them in a sentence. I'm going to give you five minutes on that. True or false, you use sub or coordinating conjunctions when combining two independent clauses. You said false, you are correct. True or false, there are a total